The family of a victim of a hit and run pleading for help days after the man was hit and killed while riding his bicycle. The victim was riding his bike when uh, this happened near 71st Avenue and Baseline Road Tuesday night. Justin Lum spoke with his sister today. He joins us live with more. Justin. And John, Christina, we met with Laura Tohey, the Navajo Nation's poet laureate. She just lost her younger brother, Mark, who she says was riding his bike to the bus stop to go to the grocery store moments before being killed. Traffic does not seem to slow down in this area of Levine near 71st Ave and Baseline Road. The cars keep coming east and west, and on Tuesday evening, just before 6, Phoenix police say the driver of a small tan or beige SUV didn't stop after colliding with the man riding a bike. Not only am I feeling this loss and this grief, but I'm also feeling anger. Laura Tohey wanted to see the spot for herself. The victim in the hit and run crash is her little brother, 57 year old Mark Tohey. She says she raised him and remembers his gentle personality. He was also very, um, he used to like to joke and make, you know, just laugh. Now she must help lay her brother to rest. Mark lived in the area with friends and was headed to the bus stop to catch a ride to Fry's for groceries. Police say the suspect vehicle continued east on baseline after hitting Mark. The father of five died at the hospital. For Laura, she's now lost three brothers in the last three years. I'll miss my brother. There's going to be, you know, a big space in my life now because of all the, of all the brothers I've lost. Investigators are searching for leads to identify the suspect. Laura hopes that person comes forward so her brother can have justice. I hope that you have a conscience that you can turn yourself in and take responsibility for what you've done because you've hurt everyone in my family as well as yourself. And this is not going to go away. If you have any information, please call Silent Witness at 480 Witness. You can remain anonymous and you could be eligible for a reward up to $1,000. Reporting live, Justin Lum, Fox 10 News.